Hello everyone, my name is Desmond. In today's episode, I will be showing you how you can captivate your audience by using the Epson Creative Projection app. These applications will help you to create impressive and low-cost projection signage solutions for you and your customers. In this episode, I will also be making use of the Epson Creative Projection app to create exciting contents using the preloaded templates and showing you how to schedule them as playlists. It has been getting more and more challenging to retain customers' attention, especially at the storefronts where every brands are fighting for the customer's attention. Often racking your brains on how to make your products or even your digital signage applications more interesting? Well, fret not. The Epson Creative Projection app is here to address your challenges. Using this app, you can create, customize and project promotional messages, effects and even experiences using your iPhone or iPad for free. This can be even done on the go by just using the app. This app is also compatible with our Lightsyn products and their lineup. Now, let me show you how to create contents using the preloaded templates. First, download the app through the Apple App Store. Once you have done so, you are now ready to start. Start Epson Creative Projection App. From the template tab on the content list screen, select the template that you would like to use. For this demo, I'll use template 001. Tap on the template name and the preview screen will be displayed. Select connect to a projector by clicking on the icon located at the top right. Please make sure that your iOS device and your projector is connected on the same network. You can also make use of one of the following methods to select the projector you want to connect to. 1. Select from a list of projectors on the network. 2. Scan the QR code projected from the projector. And 3. Select from a list of projectors in the connection lock. When you are prompted to do so, enter the projector keyword and the web control password. When a successful connection is made, the projector connection indicator will be changed. After which, a preview of the content will be projected from the projector. Once you are done, click on the top right icon, then save to the projector. After doing so, you will be led to a save to projector page. From your favourite playlist on the right of the screen, Select the playlist which you want to register content in and tap on Save. Once you are done, the Save to Projector window will automatically close and return to the previous page. Do note that saving takes about less than 5 minutes and please do not use any other applications while saving to prevent the process from being cancelled. Once saving has been completed, you can now close the app. You can start playing your content by accessing the buttons under Favorite Playlist on the remote control. Now, I will guide you on how to edit your contents. You can edit your contents and make it more interesting by placing stamps and change the overlapping order of the objects, like what you are seeing on the screen. Start Epson Creative Projection app. From the template tab on the content list screen, tap template 002. Then the preview screen is being displayed. On the preview screen, tap on the edit icon at the bottom right. The content editing screen is displayed. Click on the layer icon located at the bottom right side and a thumbnail of each object is displayed. Press and hold the chosen frame of the thumbnail to select on it. And then move it by dragging and dropping. The frame will now overlap the text. You can customize or change it with multiple templates. Once you are done, tap inside the screen to close the thumbnail screen. If you want to add in more stamps or more animation, 
click on Add Icon located at the bottom right hand corner. You can choose the stamps of your choice. In this example, I've chosen the Christmas stamps. You can place the stamps at any part of the grid areas. You can even pinch in and pinch out to adjust the size of the stamps or drag and drop to a specific location. You can save this file by clicking on the default template name and change it accordingly. Once you are done, you can click on the tick icon on the top right. This content is now saved to My Jobs tab on the content list screen. To project, you can refer to the earlier steps. In this segment of the video, we will show you how to create exciting animations of a product. Let's take this watch for example. Start Epson Creative Projection app. And from the template tab on the content list screen, tap blank template. Select connect to a projector from the projector icon on the top right of the app. Do make sure that your iOS device and light scene projector is connected on the same network. Use one of the following methods to select the projector you want to connect to. Select from a list of projectors on the network, scan the QR code from the projector, or select a list of projectors in the connection log. Depending on your connection method, key in the projector keyword or web control password accordingly. When a successful connection is made, the projector connection indicator will be changed. Tap on the Add icon on the bottom right. Now, I would like to add a spotlight effect on the watch. Click on Spotlight. And then select the spotlight effect you want to use. The spotlight is placed in the centre of the screen. You can drag the spotlight to the position of the watch while checking the preview from the projector. With the spotlight selected, pinch out or pinch in to the screen to adjust the size of the spotlight. To add effects to the content, press on the Add icon on the bottom right. Tap Effects and then select the effect you want to use from Power Up. The screen effect settings is displayed. You can draw the line at the position where the watch is being placed while checking the preview and grid from the projector. The effect pulse up where you want to draw it. If you have accidentally made a mistake, don't worry. You can simply erase the effect by tapping on the eraser mode. Once you have done, click on finish and you'll be brought back to the content editing screen. You can also choose to add tags and stickers to enhance your digital signage content, such as featuring the unique selling points of the product or its function. To save the edited content to your device, tap on the title on the top to rename the file and then tap on the tick icon on the top right of the content editing screen. The content is now saved to My Jobs tab on the content list screen. You may also refer to the earlier steps on how to create your playlist. So, as you can see, it is effortless and fast-free to create your very own digital signage contents to make your products stand out from the crowd and also to improve your customers' experiences using Epson Light Scene Series. With Epson Light Scene Series, we have a product that suits your projection signage requirement, especially with the right range of connectivity. Furthermore, we have products that addresses every installation challenges, from a short throw to ultra short throw, or even a standard throw. We are confident that we have a product that suits you. Together with Epson Creative Projection App, enjoy a better digital signage customizing experience today. Thank you.